Good morning, Virgo, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Will's Cartomancy Tarot. If you're new to my channel, I certainly appreciate both your viewership as well as your subscriptions. Okay, so what I like to do is to give you a more financial or work-related type reading, uh, and more end-of-year reading, just to see how your money situation will be from now until the end of this period. Rest assured, ladies and gentlemen, that this reading, as with any other reading, may not and will not resonate with each and every one of you out there. But for those for whom this reading is meant, I certainly hope it offers you the valuable information that you're seeking to make more uh, mature choices when it comes to your financial situation. Keep in mind, ladies and gentlemen, that if this reading does resonate, give it a big thumbs up. Share it with others to whom you think might benefit. And take a few moments to press that subscription button so that you receive any forthcoming readings that I post. Okay? So with that said, I'm going to use my Oracle of the Dead, Tarot of the Dead cards here to illustrate your reading. All right? So let's go on and just see what the overarching energy is that pervades your reading. And then we're going to move on and discuss the past, the present, what's not important in your situation. And then we'll turn our attention to what then is important. And then I'll share with you potential obstacles or pitfalls that might come into play to impede success. Then I will share with you what is hidden and end this reading with giving you, and ladies and gentlemen, a probable outcome of when you can expect to receive money if you continue on as you are, okay? So, Spirit, what messages would you like for me to share with Virgos in regards to this situation? What situation? What messages would you like for me to share to Virgos in regards to their current situation, okay? Let's go on and just again start with just by selecting a few cards from the bottom of the deck just to get an overall feel here. Okay, we have, um, let's see here. We have strength. Okay. We have, ladies and gentlemen, the world. And we also have judgment. Okay, these are all positive cards, ladies and gentlemen. So what I'm seeing here is I, you know, I'm seeing a possibility of an impressive interview that's going to come about for you guys. I feel that you certainly um, hold a very strong position. Some of you might even consider even um, pursuing higher education or even getting a new degree here I'm getting. But I'm certainly seeing a breakthrough of some sort that is certainly going to be coming to, um, towards you guys. You know, a breakthrough as it relates to your financial um, situation here. So uh, just to kind of give you a story here, I'm kind of seeing that you are very, very um, courageous. And thus, I feel that financial growth and success are in, certainly within reach. It seems that many of you have come to uh, an end of a cycle and prosperity is indeed imminent. And some of you might even um, settle a legal debacle and receive a settlement of some sort, even a new job for some of you or for those of you who are, in fact, actively looking and have been applying. And some of you may have been also expecting money I'm kind of getting, okay? Because I'm kind of getting a strong indication that uh, many of you, you're going to receive, ladies and gentlemen, it very soon. And I feel it's going to be within a week or sooner for some of you guys. I see the money is forthcoming. Okay? If you haven't already gotten this, for those of you who have not received this money or uh, money that is to come towards you, these cards are kind of giving a strong sense that patience is in fact required. But rest assured, as I indicated, the money is indeed forthcoming. I also see many of you, ladies and gentlemen, getting a bonus a raise, or a perhaps um, some of you might even decide to make a decision um, to utilize resources or money um, to really purchase property or 
you might even consider investing in, it looks like it could potentially be a foreign type investment, which I get, see that it will add what you receive from it is going to add to the bottom line. Or money could just simply, ladies and gentlemen, flow from um, unexpected sources. It could come from an inheritance or something from the government, probably a tax refund or something like that. But I do get a strong indication, you know, that a lot of you sometimes compare your financial situations to others who may have uh, perhaps exceeded where, where you are in life here. Okay. It's time to stop doing that and just be a bit more grateful for, for the things that you have. Okay. Stop beating yourself up. Over, which, over things over which you have no control. Yes, granted, you may have made poor financial decisions in the past, but your past certainly does not determine your future. Okay? And know that it's your time. This is your time, Virgos, to shine that I'm...